What is going on, beautiful people? I am Lee Hammock, the diagnosed self-aware narcissist, and welcome to another episode of A Narcissist Explains. Short edition, five minutes or less, y'all. Stick around, stick around. Today's episode is going to be about how a narcissistic person will threaten to leave you rather than work out any issues or take any, any accountability. Stay tuned, like, and subscribe. The narcissist or the toxic person in your life is going to threaten to leave you as a way to instill fear in you so that you stop arguing. It's just a way to control you. Whatever problem or feelings or emotions that you're bringing up to them that are valid, that they don't want to hear, they'll just shut down by saying, maybe we should just be done. Maybe I'll just leave. And I promise if you were to call their bluff and say, you know, you're right. I think it is about time we break up. Well, they're not going to be okay with that either. And they're not going to allow that breakup. So welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. So that creator, uh, her name is Stand Coaching. Stand Coaching is at the bottom of her video. Um, her name is Catherine, and she's a survivor of narcissistic abuse, makes a lot of great videos. Check her out on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, and whatnot. Um, but her video was extremely true, y'all. It's just saying that narcissistic people will just threaten to leave you rather than take any accountability, rather than hear you yabber on about what they've done wrong to you. Bye. You can leave. The door's right there. If you're not, if you're not happy here, why don't you just leave? You know, you don't have to be around here, right? You know, we don't have to be married, right? We don't have to be in a relationship, right? If I'm not good enough for you, just leave. They're offering you the door rather than work on things. And if you don't, if you don't leave, so this is how it works right here in the narcissist brain. If you don't leave, that is the conflict resolution right there. If you do not leave me when I open the door and give you this out, that's you saying that you are in agreement or you're just going to leave the issue alone. And leaving the issue alone or remaining silent on you, on it is conflict resolution for narcissistic people. That's the end of the conflict. That's the end of the issue. No more accountability. You can't bring it up anymore because you stayed, which means you're okay with it. That's how the narcissistic person mind works right there. But just like Catherine said, sometimes if you call their bluff, they will kind of go, they might go become obsessive and go crazy on you and make it seem like you are the enemy here in this situation. You know, you, wow, wow, you just gonna leave just like that? Wow, you gonna leave me? And you, so you, wow, you never really loved me. You never really cared about me. You gonna leave me over something so trivial? You're not gonna believe me. Everybody leaves me, everybody abandons me. Now it's a guilt trip coming. Not all, so not all narcissists are going to behave the same way, but a lot of them will do this, y'all. They'll tell you to leave, and if you take that offer, they'll try to keep you from leaving. They might lock the door. They might try to ho hold you hostage in the house and beg and plead and cry and still won't resolve the issue. They just don't want you to leave. The issue is still unresolved. And you're still there. So the, situa the mindset is still the same. You didn't leave, so it must be okay. That's why I say if you do want to leave these people, some of these people, make sure that you protect yourself and be as safe as possible because you look in the news, Google it. People are sending, sending their ex exes to meet God at an astonishing rate right now because they get so heartbroken and so just, they think they own you and they, you belong to them. They'll send you to meet God. So I was going to say, protect yourself at all costs. You just have to because so many people will absolutely go ballistic if you decide to leave them. If you take them up up on their offer to leave, they might go ballistic on you. That's it. Like, well, Lee, that's not fair. I understand it's not fair. That's why I'm putting it out there for you to see and for you to hear. I understand. I completely understand that it's not fair. But that's the mindset of what happens when you're dealing with a narcissist or a toxic person. It just is, y'all. I don't make the rules. You know, that's just how the narcissist mind works. Some of these people are super obsessive and will harm you if you try to leave them. So be as safe as possible. You don't have to tell them the plan all the time. You can leave when they're at work. That's what my wife did. My wife left when I was at work. You no, know, I was I was dropping my son off. I was gone. I wasn't at home. She left when I wasn't at home. She didn't tell me either. She didn't tell me until I got home. But stay empowered, stay safe, and like and subscribe for more. And follow Stand Coaching on all platforms. She's an amazing creator, y'all. Stay tuned for more. Like and subscribe. Peace.